Philippe Coutinho is dominating transfer headlines once again after sealing his return to the Premier League. Four years on from his Liverpool exit, the Barcelona misfit is heading back to England to join forces with former teammate Steven Gerrard at Aston Villa. The West Midlands club will pay the majority of Coutinho's wages and he will spend the remainder of the season on loan at Villa Park. Coutinho was signed by Barcelona from Liverpool for a club record £146 million in January 2018, but he has struggled to hold down a first-team place at the No Camp and spent the 2019-20 season on loan at Bayern Munich. Elsewhere, Cristiano Ronaldo's Manchester United future is in question, with the star ready to quit this summer if the club's next managerial appointment isn't to his liking. The 36-year-old is back in England for the first time in a decade, having completed an emotional Old Trafford return at the end of the summer window. And individually, the move has gone swimmingly, scoring 14 times in 20 appearances since leaving Juventus. Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang remains a target for Newcastle and the Arsenal striker is said to be keen on the switch to St James, where Kieran Trippier has become the new owner's first signing. Have approached Arsenal to sign ex-Gunners captain Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang on a loan-to-buy deal, according to reports. The Magpies are looking at bringing Gabonese striker Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang, 32 to St James Park for the remainder of the season with the option to make the move permanent in a deal worth £20 million. Aubameyang, who bagged a brace for Arsenal when the Gunners defeated London rivals Chelsea in the 2020 FA Cup final, has had a tough time of late at the Emirates under manager Mikel Arteta, 39. Liverpool striker Divock Origi could be one of the players to make way during a winter of squad trimming at Anfield, with Nat Phillips another being linked with a big money exit, but the Reds want £15 million. So far, three Serie A sides have approached the Belgians' representatives about a potential move but Origi is set on staying in the Premier League. One Premier League club has come out and offered Origi a lifeline to stay in the UK, Newcastle United. But Liverpool still have the advantage of keeping him if they want. That's the latest news from around the Premier League. Leave your thoughts and comments below and remember to like the video and subscribe for more news and updates.